Hey, Mark, good morning. Yeah, again, if you're just joining us, folks, I'll give you a little proximity. We're talking about the 18th and Vine District from 18th and Vine to 19th and Vine. That entire street is blocked off right now because we have at least two structures on fire. Two of the structures are vacant buildings, we're told, and one structure that uh, they're working on now and hoping not to catch fire is a facade from a movie. Let me get out of the way and show you behind me. You can see it raging big time back there. The roof has already caved in on top of that roof. And Mark, as you talked about earlier, that tar is catching fire on that roof right there. That building right there you're seeing is directly across the street from Jazz Club, Club Mardi Gras, if y'all are familiar with that area right now. But firefighters, as you can see, trying to get a handle on this. Now, there isn't another building on the other side of the road there because that's the intersection of 19th and by an empty parking lot on that side. So they don't really have to worry about it spreading that way. The problem is if it spreads back across Vine Street where the Jazz Place is and there are some other buildings over there. But this building is the one that's connected to the movie facade and they're trying to keep that one from catching fire. And also, they got a pretty good handle on the first structure fire that we showed you a little bit earlier. Right now, they're pouring uh, gallons and gallons and tons of water on that fire right now. But uh, as you can see here, man, you don't need any words to describe what's going on. Massive fire on the roof of a historic uh, building here down at 18th and Vine. Guys, look at this video. Amazing. Live pictures. Sad. Amazing, but sad. Uh, if you Rob, I was on Google Earth and uh, looking at this area, and you can look down on the roofs, and they're all pretty much flat roofs. They're 100 plus year old buildings that have this dry kindling basically in it now from the wood having dried out over a century. Uh, that's why it's burning so fast. And the roofs are flat, tar pitch roofs. And so when those embers float down onto those roofs, you can imagine uh, it spreads pretty quickly. I think uh, Michelle said the winds are about under 10 miles an hour about 10 miles an hour right now. Kathy Quinn sent us a picture of what this building looks like. If we can put that up. Uh, this is from the Robert Altman film, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Bridge. It was uh, about the 1920s and 30s, the heyday of jazz uh, in the Kansas City area. Uh, she was in that movie and uh, she's down there as well, gathering some more information on this breaking news story, a big fire in the 18th and Vine District. Kansas City. I'm sorry, Robert Kansas Altman. City, you're right. You're yeah, right. Mark, firefighters now uh, pouring more water on top of it, uh, trying to keep some trees. There are a couple of trees on the other side of this building right here, and uh, they're trying to keep those trees from catching fire. I can see the tops of them right now. A couple of those are red now. They're kind of burning, so firefighters are attacking this one. And I can tell you the roof has already caved in. One firefighter told me that a little bit earlier, that the roof's caved in. So. Hopefully they can get a good handle on this fire as they uh, attack it with more and more water from above. And Rob, you said there was a pot potentially one person injured in this. That's uh, unconfirmed at this time, Abby, but uh, yes, we're talking to folks uh, here on the scene and they said the ambulance took one person away. We don't know the extent of the injuries, but again, that's not uh, confirmed from fire officials, just from someone who was here at the time that it happened. Okay, thank you, Rob.